Now, the problem is we're even realizing, we used to be told that the stomach was so acidic, nothing could grow there. Hmm. Uh, lie. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just like, uh, oh, the Yellowstone geysers are so hot, nothing can grow there. And then you look at the Grand Pris Prismatic Spring and yep. all the different colors are bacteria, bacteria. and bacteria. organisms growing in it. Yeah. <laughs> well, it turns out the stomach does have certain things that can grow there. And those probiotics uh, that are growing there have benefit for the innate immune system, which oh. is the one your mom gives you. And apparently they're very important in infants to get the innate immune system working and to keep yeah. it going. Now, the problem is when we change the pH of the stomach, we change the pH um, upward, which means it's more alkaline, yeah. and those bacteria can't grow as well. Mm. So it gives an opportunist that we call H. pylori, uh. okay, which is associated with stomach ulcers and inflammation. Okay. And it's what a lot of us doctors test for when we see chronic indigestion. Mm. 